If you're the type of presenter who likes to put notes on your slides, this update is for you. With this feature, you can download your presentations as PDFs with your notes positioned below your presentation slides in a single document. Without further ado, let's hop in. As a speaker and an educator, I'm always looking for ways to communicate more succinctly with my words, but also dynamically with my graphics. Canva Presentations is my go-to place to create a slide deck to accompany my talks and create a very engaging delivery with some of the features that they have available. So I do a lot of tutorials about this topic. I would encourage you to look in the description of this video so that you can check them out when you have a bit more time. I have a video about how to import PowerPoints, refresh the look and feel, and even save it as a PowerPoint within Canva, how to turn your cell phone into a presentation clicker so that you can progress your own slides and add special effects to your presentation, and also how to record yourself presenting your presentation within Canva. All of those are covered and linked in the description. And remember, when I show you features within Canva, I'm always demoing within a Canva Pro account. So if you don't have Canva Pro and you would like access to everything, simply use my link, lashondabrown.com slash Canva45 to get access to a free 45 day trial. A common question that I've received as I've done more and more tutorials about Canva presentations is how do I create it in Canva and then present it using Keynote? You guys know that I am a PC user, but there is a way for you to do this. And quite simply, all you need to do is create your presentation in Canva, click on share, click on download, and then instead of PDF, you want to select PNG. From there, make sure all of your slides are selected under all pages and then download your presentation as individual images. When you do this and you go into Keynote, all you need to do is add blank slides and make the background of your slides your Canva images. This will give the look and feel of Canva presentation, but it will allow you to utilize the features within Keynote. So if for some reason you've been asked to create a Keynote file, that is a very simple workaround, which will still allow you to design it in Canva. So hopefully that helps you out there. Now on a recent Zoom call, I joined the team at Groove and a fellow educator to talk about the book Atomic Habits. If you are an online entrepreneur, I'm sure you have heard about this book recently. It's taking the internet by storm and it's all about building healthy habits. Now, what we did for this particular Zoom call is we created a slide deck to help guide the conversation and we collaborated on the content of the presentation. So there was a section where Lauren talked about her favorite takeaways, where I talked about mine and Taylor led the call at the beginning and the end. So what's great about designing in Canva presentations it's very similar to a Google Doc collaboration moment. You can share the link to what you're trying to create to those involved. They can quite simply drop in their texts, their photos, and even their comments. And you can also collaborate directly in your Canva presentation. So if you are co-presenting with members of your team or you're bringing in other experts to present alongside you, this is a really cool way to navigate that. One thing that Taylor did that I really loved is she added notes to the presentation by clicking on presenter notes. And so this helped us to know who was leading which particular slide. So we didn't have to privately chat within the Zoom call. We knew based on the presentation notes that people couldn't see who was talking about which particular slide. Now Canva has added the ability for you to download your notes when you download your presentation. So you can utilize that to collaborate with other people and present in a very seamless way, but you can also use it for yourself if you're presenting in person 
and you want to have your notes in front of you along with the slides so that you can stay on track. To download it, just click on Share in the top right-hand corner, go down to Download, and this time you want to select PDF and simply include your notes. So this is going to be an awesome way for speakers to continue to present themselves in a professional manner. Again, this is something that I utilized in PowerPoint and I'm really excited to see this feature within Canva. When you click on download, it's going to download a PDF that you can either print or leave open on a cell phone and, or an iPad. And for those of you who may be wondering, it takes a single slide, puts it at the top of the PDF and puts the notes underneath. So this particular presentation was 19 slides. So therefore there are 19 pages. However, you could put multiple pages on a single page if that's what you wanted to do when you went to print. So you can download it from Canva. This is the format it will be in. Feel free to reformat it to fit your needs so that you can present your presentation in a seamless fashion. Thanks so much for watching this video. I'm LaShonda Brown, a Canva verified expert from Virginia. If you would like a Canva Pro free trial for 45 days, visit LaShondaBrown.com slash Canva45. If you like this video, you'll definitely want to check out my tutorial about how to turn your phone into your clicker for your next presentation. Until next time, to top for now.